hello friends welcome to you all today we are going to start a new dimension of anatomy a new subject the embryology so today is our first class of embryology so today we will discuss about some of introduction the definition and the branches of embryology so what the embryology means embryology it is a study of the embryo means it is a study of a person before its birth if we define the embryology so the definition of the embryology is like that embryology is the study of an individual before its birth or we can also define it scientifically like embryology is a study of formation and development of an embryo from its inception to till its birth as an infant okay what the embryology means embryology is a study of an individual before its birth or embryology is the study of formation how it is formed then how it is developed what the embryo from its inception means when from the fertilization when the sperm and ovum mingles and uh, the uh, fetus is formed this process it is known as a fertilization okay so from the fertilization means from its inception to till its birth means the whole 9 months period of intra uterine uterine life the whole 9 month development of the intra uterine life it is studied in the head of the embryology so it is the definition of the embryology you must have to remember that the embryology is the study of formation and development of the embryo from its inception to till its birth as an fetus okay as an infant sorry as an infant okay uh, when the baby is uh, uh, delivered then after it is known as an infant okay so it is the study of the formation and development of an embryo from its inception to till its birth as an infant okay this is the definition of the embryology then we will discuss all the time about the two different words one is the embryo and one is the fetus what is the embryo and what is the fetus means when the baby is developed till the 2 months means from the fertilization to till the 2 month the developing baby it is known as an embryo and then after it is known as a fetus means the first two month of developing baby at that time it is known as a embryo and then after it is known as a fetus okay now the branches of embryology so there are main six branches of embryology so they are the descriptive embryology then the comparative embryology then the experimental embryology chemical embryology teratology and developmental embryology so first is the descriptive embryology okay so in this type of the study the direct observation and description of the developing embryo is done means it is done by the direct observation and is description is done so this type of the study it is known as a descriptive embryology okay it can be done by the usg and all that then the comparative embryology so what is the comparative embryology in this type of the study the development of different species is studied and then it is compared okay so 
from that type of the comparison we can evaluate the evaluation process of the different species okay so it is very much important the comparative embryology in this study the different species the development process of different species is studied analyzed and described okay then the experimental embryology in the experimental embryology the developmental stages are defined okay means at the different stage of development the embryos are dissected and then studied and at that time they are also done uh, that uh, some organs are removed and some are implanted some genes are removed and implanted and then how it is developed it is studied so this type of experimental study it is done in the experimental embryology that's why it is also known as a analytical embryology okay so the experimental embryology it is also known as the analytical embryology then the chemical embryology okay in this type of the study the biochemical the biophysical and physiological uh, different treatments are done to the embryo and then the study is done okay so that's why it is also known as a biochemical embryology or it is also known as a physiological embryology okay then the teratology what is the teratology teratology it is a the study of the malfunctions of the embryo means the, uh, the uh, due to the genetical causes or due to any other causes when there is a malfunction in the embryo so uh, in, in this uh, study in the teratology this all things are studied why the malfunction is occurs it is due to some chemicals or all that this is study it is done in the teratology then the developmental biology so it is a branch of the biology actually and in this developmental biology it is not only study the development of an embryo the developmental stages of the embryo but it is also study the postnatal development okay the postnatal normal or neoplasmic growth the reparative procedures and all that postnatal study it is also done in the developmental biology okay so this is the main six branch of the uh, embryology okay so this is all about the introduction of the embryology in the next lecture we will discuss about the dna structure so thank you thank you very much